Hello, here's your latest Met Office weekend weather update as we look at the weather we can expect through the last weekend of 2024. Now we are starting to lose the influence of the high pressure that's brought all the calm but quite cloudy weather for many of us through the Christmas period and that means we're going to see some fronts starting to push their way in. Initially as we go through Saturday there will be a relatively weak frontal system making its way southwards across parts of Scotland and into Northern Ireland being, bringing a, a bit of wet weather for a time and some of that rain will push into the far north of England as we go through later on in the day as well. But to the north of this front, we're actually going to see some bright or sunny spells developing, but also a scattering of blustery showers at times too. Elsewhere and across the rest of England and much of Wales, it's pretty similar to how it has been over the past couple of days really. Lots of cloud around, lots of grey skies and that cloud could be quite low, so some hill fog in places and some patches of fog elsewhere being pretty slow to low uh, to lift and to clear away quite a grey gloomy picture once again and there will be some drizzly rain in places as well. With all that cloud quite a chilly feel to things again especially towards the north despite the fact that there will be some sunny spells here I think it will be quite chilly for some and even elsewhere with that cloud then yes feeling pretty cold not too surprising for the time of year. Later on on Saturday and as we go overnight into Sunday that weak front is going to continue its way southwards but it really dies a death and eases as it goes so most places not seeing a huge amount of rain in association with this system. It's another frontal system that pushes in across parts of Scotland as we go into Sunday that's going to bring some heavier more persistent rain here. As well as that we are going to see some strong winds so a wet and windy picture across much of Scotland as we go through Sunday. Otherwise and across much of Northern Ireland many parts of Northern England and towards the, the south coast. A fair bit of cloud here, also some cloud across many parts of Wales, but there will be more sunshine on offer on Sunday than we've seen of late, especially across some central parts of England towards the east East Anglia and even across some parts of South Wales, the southwest here we should see some bright or sunny breaks developing, so more sunshine than we have seen recently. And with that temperatures are going to be a little bit higher, around or perhaps even a touch above average for the time of year, although there's some colder air coming into to the far north of the UK and with that we could see some sleet or snow over the higher ground of Scotland. The most unsettled weather though is to come as we go through next week. We are going to see a strengthening jet stream driving various areas of low pressure. So initially an area of low pressure comes through on Monday increasing the rain and some strong winds too but then a deeper low is likely to come through as we go through New Year's Eve and into New Year's Day and so it's this one that's most likely to bring the greatest disruptive weather. Now there is some uncertainty about it in terms of both the track that it's going to take. It could be a little bit further south could be a little bit further north than this these graphics here suggest and also the exact timing it may be a bit slower than this suggests and in fact we could see the most severe weather on New Year's Day itself rather than New Year's Eve but nonetheless it does look like it is going to be pretty unsettled for many of us especially towards the north of the UK as we go towards the end of 2024 and the beginning of 2025. Thereafter that low should clear through and we could get a bit more drier settled but colder weather as we go for a little bit beyond and deeper into the beginning of January. So you'll want to keep up to date with the forecast especially with the potential for some unsettled weather to end the year. Make sure you do so by keeping up to date with our YouTube channel. Bye-bye.